Bam! Back with another budget review today. We're going to do a little 91 overall review. I see you budget players out there watching my videos. We're going to do a little 100k player review. That's how much he's going for about right now. He only gets two ability slots, which is weird because I think there's some 89s out there. Get three ability slots. What is going on with that? I do not know. I thought he should have three ability slots, but getting to the review. 95 speed is what's going to stick out, obviously, with the 92 spec catch. Now, I'm going to tell you right now that 92 spec catch is going to be fake news. He is not going to jump up and make crazy catches for you. Do not depend on that when you get this card. Some of my more unexperienced players ask me these questions. Uh, you're not going to win a game by throwing up 500 spec catches, okay? But however, his speed is going to get the separation for him. And his carry will be an A. He did not drop the ball. He took hit sticks. Well, he drops the ball there in traffic. But I mean, when he catches the ball, he's not going to fumble it. I had no issues out of that. So don't think his fumbles are going to be out of control. It were They were not. He, His speed actually pays for this card. His speed's going to be an A. He will be worth the coins because of the speed the separation he will get as you see in my video most of my plays are going to be just touchdowns because he's going to be able to speed past people so as route running is going to be a b he is not going to you know out route run someone but his speed is going to get the separation on the route so it's going to be a b so streaks and drags and deep slants are going to help him by deep slants i mean put him on a slant and his limb drag all the way across the screen like this right here eventually his speed will overcome their zone and main coverage because this is how this game works and as we know in this game speed is king moves are gonna be b plus his juke feels so much better you can zigzag in and out his elusiveness and you see here his spin is not the best and uh, beginning of the video, that, that play was absolutely ridiculous. Um, <laughs> but um, his juke does work. So the main question, like I said earlier, is he worth the coins? Absolutely, guys. His budget B, especially if you're a Ravens team team, he will get the job done for you. If he gets matched up on a linebacker on a streak, that is going to be an easiest touchdown you ever threw in your life. So his speed will feel good. And you see, he does break a tackle there. It was not a common thing, though. Overall, he is going to be a B because catching in traffic is not going to be good on this card. And as always, guys, help others for no reason. That's always the message. And as we compare him right here against some other players, uh, speed is king, so I pick him over Diggs for that reason. But as you see, Brown. Brown is going to have 97 speed. So you could go Brown over him for that reason as well. Brown did play a slightly better than me, but Pierre did not drop any balls. He will not cost you the game. If you have 100K, I say go get him. You'll enjoy that card. And I really want to thank you guys for getting 100 likes on this video. Appreciate all support. And as well, he's better than Robbie Anderson. I will see you in the next one.